Welcome to the Control M Video Solutions channel. Today we are going to show you how to create a remote secure shell host via the command line. This can come in handy when you want to automate the creation of many agents or you do not have access to the CCM. To define a remote host, the first step is to create a run as user for this host via CTM set on. We will then use CTM host map to create the remote host. We will verify our configuration by running a job which displays the user ID and review the sysout to verify it's correct. We're now going to do a demo to show you how this works. Okay, our first step here is we want to set up a user with CTM set on. So let's go up here and get the usage. Okay, and let's walk through the steps here. CTM set own minus action add minus run underscore as. We're going to use the user CTM 800P and we're going to set the host um, that we're testing with RH6-64 SSL. And we're going to use a key. specify its passphrase. Okay, and we can verify this with a CTM set own minus action list. All right, let me see our user now. So the next step here is to do CTM host map. All right, and let's go through the steps of this. CTM host map, minus action, add, minus host, RH6-64-SSL, and minus agent, this is our RJX agent, which is actually the physical agent that submits the job. And then we have to specify the protocol. And then we want to specify the, the SSH port, which is 22. And we want to do the encryption algorithm. And we're not going to use compression since that tends to eat more CPU than time it actually takes to transmit it when you're on a LAN. Okay, it completed successfully. We're now going to verify this by running a CTM host map minus action list. Okay. And we can verify this uh, connectivity just by running a CTM underscore diag underscore com RH6-64-SSL. Okay, and here you can see that the agent that we proxied through was the CLM PUN-027437. And if we want to verify this, let's just go on ahead and do a quick CTM create job. So we're going to go ahead and run a test job here. We've got a command ready. And what this is going to do is just do a who am I and a host name. So what we're going to do now is look at the output and we're just going to use the CTM PSM command. Just for order ID 6HI. Uh, and so this is actually going to the agent and pulling the sys out. And here we can see that the user ID is the CTM800P and the host name is the RH664SSL. Um, that concludes our demo. Thank you for your time. The Controlum support team looks forward to helping you should you need our assistance.